Whether you revise using the Revise Bike List screen, the Points Revision screen, or the Sticky List screen, the format remains the same. Start by setting your filters to your preferred settings. A general rule of thumb for beginners is to set the times asked to 20 times or more. You can select to revise just today's points or as many as one year's worth of points. You can also select specific groups or individual examiners. On the questions section of the screen you will see how many times this specific question has been asked. To the right you will see how many points are in this revision group and how many you have revised so far. Say your answer out loud to yourself, then tap the screen to display the answer. You now choose if you were correct, sticky or did not know. By selecting sticky, the point will automatically be placed in your sticky list for further revision. By selecting don't know, it will automatically be placed into your bike list screen, ready to be added to a bike list. Another way to test yourself is by activating the map. The map will randomly be off-center to make testing feasible. If you tap the screen accurately enough, then only one option for a correct answer will be displayed. If your tapped answer is reasonably close, you'll be given the option to say don't know, sticky or correct. If however your answer is completely wrong, you'll be given just two options, don't know or sticky. Whenever you choose to exit the revision, you will be given a summary of how well you have done. Your home screen statistics will be updated to show your current standings. It is also important to note that if you set the filters here for postcode or category, your revision will only revise those postcodes or categories or both.